Hey football fans, welcome back to Football News Center. Today, we have an exclusive interview with Brentford striker, Ivan Tony, who opens up about his difficult journey during his eight-month ban for breaching betting rules. Tony reveals that he fell out of love with football during his ban, struggling to stay engaged and even gaining weight at the start. He admits that he stopped watching football for a while, punishing himself by not enjoying the game he loves. But he soon realized that it wasn't helping him and decided to brush it aside and focus on his return. He shares how tough it was to be away from his teammates and the game he's been playing since a young age. Tony, known for his big personality, missed being the fun character in the dressing room, lifting others up and making them happy. But now, he's determined to make a comeback and repay Brent Ford for their unwavering support. Despite the confusion surrounding Newcastle midfielder Sandro Tunnelly being allowed to train during his own ban, Tony chooses not to dwell on it, acknowledging that life isn't always fair. He's focused on moving forward and making the most of his second chance. With 18 months remaining on his contract, Tony's future has been a topic of speculation, but Brentford head coach, Thomas Frank, has made it clear that the club has no intention of selling him this month. It would take an unbelievable price to tempt them into doing so. Tony expresses his gratitude towards the club and the fans for standing by him throughout his ban. He mentions the overwhelming support he received, even when he couldn't be on the field. The family atmosphere at Brentford and the efforts made by the club, including extra training sessions, have left Tony eager to repay them. Now, with Brentford facing an injury crisis and a string of losses, Tony's return couldn't come at a better time. The team is in desperate need of his goals to climb out of their current position and secure their place in the Premier League. In a recent behind-closed-doors friendly, Tony showed his prowess by scoring a hat-trick for Brentford's B team. This serves as a promising sign for the upcoming matches, where Tony's goals will be crucial for the team's success. That's all for today's update on Ivan Tony's journey back to the game he loves. Stay tuned for more football news and updates from Football News Center. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for all the latest updates. See you next time.